video of learning programming so here we are going to create a new program in C so let's understand uh, the requirement first so uh, like the requirement is like if the marks obtained by a student in five different subjects are inputted through the keyboard write a program to find the aggregate marks and the percentage marks obtained by a student assuming maximum marks obtained by a student can be 100 on each subject so with this statement we can consider that we need to input five values five integer values let's consider integer first then we can check with the float so uh, and we need to process and then we need to give two values one is aggregate mark and one is percentage mark so aggregate marks is the sum of the marks obtained which is like maximum marks will be 500 if here we have five subjects and the percentage marks is like uh, what is the percentage of uh, the marks he got uh, for that we will use the formula to calculate the percentage okay so uh, let's start the program so here first we are going to include the inbuilt library uh, so include studio dot h which what it will do is it will include the standard input output library and we need to create a method to start this uh, as like int main so this method is the initial uh, point from which this method get executed uh, now we need to input five values so first we need to initialize the values like uh, subject 1 subject 2 subject 3 subject 4 subject 5 okay so this what we have do what we have did here is like we initialize five variables with integer tag so we make this five variables of integer tag each uh, okay. so now what we will do is we will just print this statement first so that the user who are inputting the value will understand what is the requirement here uh, let's please enter the marks obtained by the student in all five subjects separating the marks with space and then press enter Two part. Let's close this one here and then create one more statement printf. So, this we can put in one printf statement, but we, for understanding, we are putting it in two so that we can have it in the same page. Okay. So, I am just adding space here. So what it will do is it will initialize the method main it will check for this statement it prints first so that customer can, user can understand so it will print please enter the marks obtained by the students in all five subjects separating the marks with the space and then press enter this is just for the uh, visibility of the user who is going to input the values then we are going to scan these values whatever values that user is going to enter we are going to scan these values percent b percent b percent b three times four times five times and then we are going to uh, subject one So 
what we are doing here is like we are just scanning the inputted values now what we need to do is we need to write a formula over it to find the aggregate mark and the percentage mark so let's create let's initialize two more variables in aggregate marks and then percentage marks okay so these are also integer types uh, for percentage let's consider it as a float because it can be like uh, something like with decimal values let's consider initially the same like float so now we are going to calculate aggregate marks first so we know the formula aggregate mark what we require is like sum of all the subjects so subject 2 plus subject 3 plus subject 4 plus uh, subject 5 so this this is the sum and this is the aggregate marks we need to uh, we need to initialize uh, we need to assign this value to a particular variable so what we are going to do is we are going to use this same variable and then we are going to print it in output print f the aggregate marks for student sorry student is and then we need to in define the variable type it's of integer and then what we need to do is we need to uh, give the value the variable aggregate so it will print the value now we need to find let's add the comment here also this line will give aggregate marks so this might feel that why you are adding the comment here but if you are creating a bigger projects or bigger applications then this comment is needed so this will this is good practice so that uh, to add the comment wherever you can so the, we are adding the new command this logic let's this logic is giving percentage marks so percentage marks is equals to we know that percentage means like we need to define at the value of 100 so we know the formula it's aggregate and then divide by number of values okay so we need to divide it by 5 we are not going to do anything else we need to divide it by 5 okay so now we are going to print this also percentage marks by student is then what we need to do is we need to initialize it first and then we need to assign this percentage marks okay so now these statements will execute on the same line for that what we can do is we need to add some what we do is new line operator we are adding this and uh, here also so that we can enter so this and add here also and here also so that the cursor will be on the new line when we end okay so this is our method let's check it first if we didn't miss anything 
we initialize these five variables this also we can do it on the same line if require let's do it like this this is a float type just to keep the space so that it will simply and look this is aggregate marks formula this is percentage marks and we are returning it okay now compile the file for compiling what we need to do is gcc hyphen o and then with what name you want to create a file it will create a file the student score average without c terminator uh, c extension and the file so it executed means like there is no error in the file now let's run the program out of the screen uh, let me clear this first now it's okay so now what we need to do is we need to run this program like this so what we got is please enter the marks obtained by the student in all five subjects separating the marks with the space and then press enter so the Let's just remove this so that it will become more clean. This also, so this we will check again. Like in let's say you are a topper, got 98, 97, 99. So we got five subjects. We are pressing enter. So what we got here is that aggregate marks for the student is 474. The percentage marks obtained by the student is 94 percent. Let's add percent also here, so it looks more cool. Okay, now let's compile this file again. For compiling, we know what we need to do is gcc hyphen o student score dot c k percent. Okay, since it's Predefined variable. Let's not add it. Okay. So now we come trying to compile it again. Now it's compiled. It means no error. Now we are going to run the method again. Student score. Now we see that this statement is like looks pretty good. Now we can say like we got something around forty five, forty, forty three, fifty, and then like say I'm dumb as student. So let's see. So we go and we are entering these five values. Now what we got is that aggregate marks is two twenty eight, and percentage marks is forty five percent. So that's it from my side for today. We will come again with another new, uh, like say, quiz for you to solve. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.